This week's election number, 50.4%. The Globe's model forecasts that the Conservatives would end up with the most seats in slightly over half of its thousand simulations. Most polls suggest a slight NDP lead, but the model predicts a toss-up between the Conservatives and the NDP in terms of who will get the most seats. It has to do with where their support is coming from. For example, many pollsters have the New Democrats doing twice as well in Alberta as they did in 2011, but coming in a strong second doesn't mean much in terms of seats. The Liberal Party isn't too far behind in terms of popular vote, but they have a low probability of winning overall. Just a 2 or 3 percentage point bump in the polls would increase their chances of winning tremendously. Until one party gains a consistent lead of 3 or 4 percentage points, this election will remain too close to call.